Ahem. I've been a little too <coughs> oh, all over the place with this game lately, in recent parts. Ever since the uh, story slowed down and we just started going through places with a lot of combat. Let's try and refocus. It doesn't help that I have a bad memory. Um, hang on. There is a shade in this ruined warehouse. It holds up its hand. Stop. I am the first of the guardians. We all will take a toll before you may pass. What? Speak with me so I may feed. No. Don't bloody think so. But yeah, like, because... Because of my memory, I could have... Like, if I had a better memory, I could have been, like more decisive about what I was going to do, like, let's head over this way, try and find our way to Goetch. And that's what I'm doing now. Ten? Flum, but... What do you want? What do you mean you want a toll? Bloody ghosts, bandits. Even beyond the grave. The greedy fuckers. Oh, a shade stands in the middle of the room. It is a wispy, insubstantial thing. Oh yeah, it's a shade. And yet it radiates powerful heat. It seems like a creation, but you've never seen anything like it. Yeah, I have. A lot of them. Do you not intend for me to come from the other direction first? Or go anywhere else first? It starts to speak in a low droning voice. It speaks your tongue, fortunately. I am a guardian, the first. All who pass must pay a price. What price do I have to pay? I must take your strength. I must make you weak. Only if you let me feed will I let you pass. I could just kill you. Um, and you have done so. You scare me. You make me feel weak. I have paid. Shades are limited creatures, and your statement confuses its simple programming. It's not a computer. It pauses for a long while. Then it says, Then you have. You must have. You have paid. You may pass. Ha! <laughs> Even ghosts can't handle my silver tongue. Does silver tongue work in this way? I don't know if it's just for like seduction or something, or if it's for convincing as well, or something like that. Who created you, Shade? Wait. Guardian speaks again. I am the guardian, nothing more is within me. I exist to be paid or to stand outside stand aside. Who created you, Shade? The shade points to the west. That way lies the answer. Oh go etch, I guess. Price has been paid. You may move on to the next. I wonder if he would have reduced my strength by one, or taken some skill points, or what. Could just fight him instead. Probably get some experience. Maybe I got some experience for giving him a good old lie as well. Shall we fight him? How much health has he got? Not a lot. Surely, let's bloody do it. No one's going to get angry in the world, are they? Oh, he's moody now. God, this would have been an even easier... easier time than clicking on the right choice. What a week. 55?! What the flitting? Are the others angry at me now? Second Guardian. The people who lived here had a thing for stone pillars. Yeah, clearly. They're bloody everywhere. Some small and intricately carved, some enormous. Some of those were carved here. Some of the logs they used to roll the blocks of stone around are still in the corner, though quite decayed. How many times do you want to say some in one text blob? This pillar is still smooth and roughly hewn. It was still being worked on when, for whatever reason, these ruins were abandoned. What do you mean, for whatever reason? I know now. Modify the text when you've reached certain events, or whatever. Which usually does happen, but not today. I just accidentally quick loaded instead of... whatever. Luckily I save regularly. God, this is why I put quick save on F5 and quick load on F9. Or at least F8. Not again, so they're not right next to each other and getting accidentally pressed. I also near first, actually. Right, there's no guardian in here, so we might as well do this first. But let me just bloody plug in my phone again. Okay, right, what have we got in here? Some knowledge. 
This crypt is unfinished, the sides are still rough and the corners still rounded. There is nothing inside but dust. It must have been a work in progress when the residents of this town left. This silly town called the Sentinels. <laughs> I just stole from a crypt. Is anyone going to get angry? Why is there a hammer in the crypt? That hammer is dead. Well, I guess that was cool. Got some gems. Always a nice thing to see. They are pretty nice looking gems as well. Look at that. Especially those though. Mmm. Like, this isn't even just me playing into the whole dragon character. I do love gems. Especially Spyro gems, especially in the remake. Oh! I would splurt on them. What? A shade stands in the middle of the room. It's a. Yeah, you yeah. know. Wait, oh no, this is slightly different. And yet, um, there's a wispy and substantial thing, and yet it radiates powerful cold. Standing near it makes you feel slow and weak. It starts to speak in a low droning voice. It speaks your tongue, fortunately. I am a guardian, the second. All who pass must pay a price. Who created you, Shade? Shade points to the self. That will lies the answer. What price do I have to pay? I must take your speed. I must make you slow and sluggish. Only if you let me feed will I let you pass. Talk slowly. But I am already slow and sluggish. Move around slowly. Shades are limit the onion. Yeah, that's the same. What a silly. Is this comedy hour? That was like the voice I do for chipmunk mode. Maybe I should get chipmunk. I mean chippy monk ores. To help when there's a lot of battle. So we can have talk like this. No, probably not. I don't even need to do chipmunk mode. I can just sound like him. He can stay retired for all I care. Who needs him? Alright. Let me just nick whatever you've got in here before we have a chonky chat. Never mind, you ain't got anything. Third Guardian. Shade stands in the middle of the room, wispy and substantial thing, radiates powerful cold. Standing near makes you feel slow and weak. Not again. Low droning voice, I am a guardian the third. All who pass must pay a price. Who created you? Oh, what? Shade points to the east. That that way lies the answer. Hustus is beyond. What? I thought it was Goetch. What price do I have to pay? I must take your thoughts. I will have the secrets in the treasure house of your mind. Only if you let me feed will I let you pass. You want my thoughts and secrets? Here they are. Start talking. Um, you know, blah, 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 blah. Hi. Blah, blah, blah. Shades are limited creatures, and your literal mindedness confuses a simple programming. You talk, and you keep talking, telling it your opinions and ideas. A few shape of secrets, stories from your childhood, and so on. The shade seems baffled. I. I. You have to keep talking for a while, but eventually the shade seems sated. I have had enough secrets from you. I do not need to take any more. You may pass. Lol. Poor guys. Boring it with my war stories. Is there a fourth guardian around here so we can have more giggle? Some Ellie giggle. Elephant. Who is Ellie? Or Ella? Electric giggle. Oh, is that? No, I've still got the living knife. 7 to 49. Oh, it's even the same. Why does a living knife do the same damage as a steel sword? Probably because a living knife wiggles about and hurts the enemy a bit more while it's inside its inside its new wound that you just made. What's over here? Not a lot. Nope. No. Have we got a new guardian? Nope. No. Uh, oh. There's mines though. Be mighty careful, my friend. Don't hurt too much, will you? Hello? Oh. Are there any turrets down here to worry about? Probably, if I had to make a big old hefty guess. Yeah. But let's uh, stay the path for now. See what we got around here. Luckily I've still got the Tinker's Gauntlets on. Tonk! Oh, it's just back around at the start. Blimey. 
We could have just come here all... Oh, you could just skip a bunch of the tests, I guess. That's pretty cool. A fun thing about this game. Well, let me just clear out these turrets. I won't record it. You've seen enough of that. <laughs> it's horror rat! No, it isn't. Oh, what? There's some in here as well. Sorry. Oh, bloody hell, there's two. Whatever. Let me just clear out this way as well before I do all this. I thought I was done. What do you mean? What? Oh, no. The higher difficulty, for some reason. That's not very fair, is it? Even with my Tinker Gloves on. I can't be asked to go over there then, can I? Probably not. Can I even be asked to kill the turrets? They only give five. Also probably not. Um, <clears throat> I'm done caring about insignificant amounts of stuff. That's just normal sandals. This looks like an Ornk pen. Does it? I don't know. Looks like a something pen anyway. Guess I'll take the dagger because that is five gold instead of one. Oh yeah, that's so much more, Paul. I mean, Drakaya. Drakaya's gaming. You know, there is a reason those vi these videos are called Drakaya's gaming. Because they're not. That's That's the reason. God. Come on. Let's go. Oh no, is that a pain one? Probably, yeah. All we can do. I mean, all we have to do is sneak around this one. Oh. Ew. Don't really care about that, do I? Oh. Apparently the the cabinet isn't there, it's over here. It's very silly, I assure you. Okay. Bob off out of there. No, it looks like we're done with all the tests. That's a shame, that is. They were funny. Foolish ghosts. Wait. Are you telling me that other path to the left over there is not a shortcut? and is in fact an item of some sort, maybe. I might have to go there after all. Which is a bit of a shame, because I don't have the mechanics for that. Oh, hello? Oh, it's Hustus. Hustus, we have a problem. Mind if I just take your stuff before we chat? No, you haven't got any. This is a strange being. It isn't a shade. It, that's a, how is it strange? It looks like you. Looks like a tiny warped human, but it is wrapped in a thick field of dark, shimmering energy. <clears throat> it seems frail, but power flows off of it in waves. It is terribly old. It starts to communicate with you. It doesn't so much speak, though, as radiate the words. I am Hustus, guardian of the ruins. I wait here, and I take my tolls. Oh no. Who or what are you? Who already said what his name was? I am the Descendant, I am the Survivor, I am the Blessed and the Cursed. Blessed and the Cursed, whatever, both probably work. I am what remains from the war, I remember. I wait for the chance for revenge, I don't understand. These ruins, they were the centre, they were an empire. They had foul magic, the ability to warp life, to change it, to twist it. They used this power to change those who opposed them. My people were fought by them, and their war mages changed our soldiers. Their organs jellied, uh, and their minds burned, and they fell. Each changed, each in a different way. Sometimes harmless, but usually quick death. Were they like experiments for the Gene Forge when they invented it or something? Probably not. Maybe these are the people who lived here before. What happened to you? He just explained. Or what happened to you specifically, probably, yeah. I was changed, but my changes were good. I was strong, so strong, and I led the fight back. Their changes did other things. Diseases were made. Where there were no diseases. <clears throat> my warriors and the sickness destroyed their land. Um, they fled and were gone, and I stayed here waiting, waiting for them to return so I could slay them. 
I am the Sentinel. Oh, excuse me, this place is called the Sentinels. Plural. You can't be the Sentinel, there's supposed to be multiple of you. I have a weight, gaining what energy I can to sustain myself so that when they return, I can kill them. Oh, I probably don't want to say the people you fought sound like my people. Unless I get experience for beating them. <laughs> it is a long tale, full of suffering, but one day I hope it will end and I will be able to rest. What can you tell me about these ruins? They are my home. How long have you been here? I do not know. Thousands of years, something like that. Oh, describe the ruins to me. They are my home. The rest you must find for yourself. Is there anything else? Oops. Okay, I can say they are my people. Or were my people. Alright, give me a sec then. Let me see what happens. Yeah, I've got a bit of elf. But what price do I have to pay first? I must take your energy, your life essence. I will eat it and make myself strong. Only if you let me feed will I let you pass. Um, is there nothing I can do? Is there no way I can get you to let me pass without eating my life? Eat my life. Sounds like something I would say. The Shade ponders this. Yes, there is an intruder in these ruins. It calls itself Goach. It stinks to me. Oh, you're a ghost or whatever you are. Just shape your nose off. It invades and I fear it. For hear it. It is powerful. Swear to kill it, kill this goetch, and I will not only let you pass, but I will reward you with life when the deed is done. I've already got life. Couldn't be talking to you if I didn't. I could do. I guess the, the other ghosts around here are talking. Whatever. Um, but if... Uh, but if you agree, I will mark you, so you may not betray me. I will make you stink with hatred for him, of him. I already stink. You will not be able to deal with him against me, so make your choice. Hang on. I ain't choosing nothing right now. Even though I did just save it. Now let me just see about this. Sounds like my interesting story. The people you fought sound like my people. I do not know if that is true. You may be my enemy, but I do not know. Oh. I mean, I don't know him yet. Goetch is a shaper. He... Trajkov was looking for him. But he legged it, so Goetch is obviously a good guy, right? But if he's a shaper, he's probably going to be pretty pissed that I've been using the canisters. It's not very fair. I want a chance to see for myself if Goetch is worth killing. Um, yeah, I don't know. Um, shall I just kill you instead? Don't know. I will not pay. I will not deal with you. I go where I will. Then leave me and return when you have gained wisdom. But can I just pass you? Don't I have to pay the toll, yeah? Hustus shouts, stop, you have not paid. It lurches at you from behind, enveloping you. You feel drained. Then it darts back to where it was. There, I have fared to the tallest page. You may continue. Bloody hell. Decreases endurance by two. You can pee right off, mate. I ain't having that. Is that more than half? Wait, no, it less than half to my health. But, you know, pee off. Right, um... Should we just fight you? Yeah. I don't know. It depends what life he's going to give me. Maybe some endurance? Maybe I'll go back and try and go through Spirit City. It's been a while since I've been there. And also, since I've been holding on to these skill points for bloody ever. Um, I don't know. What should I put it in? What is... That's Artilla and Volish. Maybe another one of that. Seems good to me. I guess. I wouldn't mind some more intelligence. I don't know. Not for now. Oh! Anyway, uh, yeah. This is a long path, so Burb, actually. Try and do this thing down here, I guess. Oh, but that means I've got to put another point in mechanics instead, because I ain't got enough. Gosh, blimey.
just kill the turrets I suppose, but then the things will explode as well. Oh. Oh. We're probably gonna have a bit of a death if we try to attack more than one. Can we can we just hit one from out here? Perhaps. Perhaps. No, he's not there. Now he is. But I'm out of AP. Whoa. Uh, whoa. No. No, it's just impossible. Pew. Hopefully the other one doesn't get angry. Because it'll wreck me. I think. No, he's not angry yet. get out. Okay, we should be fine. Yeah. I don't want to put two more points in mechanics. I've put in as many as the guides recommended. But I guess since I'm going to be coming back here anyway, after I've met Goetch or whatever, see what he's all about, I might as well leave this as well. So hang on a sec. Let's uh, bring this up. Bloody power station. Pfft, or power core, rather. The Sentinels. Top left. Um, top left. Evil dude wants me to kill Goetch. Should I? Bottom left. Corridor of level 14 mechanics things. There we go, that'll do for now. Just so that I remember where I have and haven't been in here. Anyway, yeah. I'll see you back out there. Guess I'll go sell stuff while I'm out as well. Bloody Crescent Shade bloke came back. Uh, you know what? I just got done selling stuff to Rackus. He hasn't got any money left now. I feel bad about this because he's a friendly dragon. But those gloves, man. Those gloves. I'm sorry to do this. It's just a video game. Oh, he's so nice, though. I will not submit to you, rogue. Do your worst. The creature shrugs its reptilian shoulders. I will. If you survive, I will speak with you again, Shaper. What? If I survive? What? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry! Oh. I can't hit him. Oh no, he's impossible. He's too big and, and beefy. And beautiful. Never mind, he's too dumb. Lizard brain. Uh, at least I leveled up. His life voice... His life voice... His life force joined mine. Oh, I'm sorry, Rackus. You've... You've outlived your usefulness. Rest now. I think those gloves will come in handy. Especially since I'm struggling... Recently. Sort of. How's my dosh doing? I'm not maxed, am I, yet? I don't know what the max is going to be, if there is one in this. Uh, strength, quick action, anatomy. Yes. Wait. Yeah, strength. I guess is the main thing I wanted. I, I guess. I'm not even sure anymore, what the hell? I thought it was like something extremely useful. Strength, quick action, anatomy. Hmm. Well, I've got to level up, so I also get five skill points. At least... Oh, there is... Oh, I was about to say, at least there's no blood. Oh! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Perhaps with these new skills. Battle magic, mental magic. Where is Days? Perhaps mental magic would be better to have than... Wait, what? 
Wait, no. Oh, I have days. No, dominate. Is that days in this game? Controls the mind of a single enemy. No. I guess days isn't in this game. That's like a very useful thing. Oh, great Drake. I didn't even notice that. And Glack. What? A new... Oh, if they reach level 3, a new creation will become available. Blimey, I didn't know this stuff. That would explain where the, um... Searing... Artilla came from, and the Terror Vlish, I guess. Anyway, uh, yeah. Yes, maybe with this new level I can deal with these things a bit better. Let's, let's, I don't know. Magic shaping, I suppose. It only cost three. Uh, not that much, good. Perhaps some more intelligence. I guess for now. And let's try and save it. Wait. Hang on, let me just... I want to make a save before I do all that. Oh! Now I have to suffer... Oh god, hang on. Okay, I just wanted to make a, a safety save before I did this. Just in case it's unwise. Spell energy and essence. I don't know if I really need any more essence for now. But I did just level up, put a point in magic shaping. Let's see how this goes. I might actually have to remake the the creatures for it to have any kind of special effect. But let's try this again. Maybe I should find a good place to hold out. Cuz there are a lot of them might be an idea to sort of leave my creatures somewhere and then I take the stone and then leg it. Mm, I should put speed on as well before they start coming. Because now they're all here. Yeah, hang on. Well, not all of them, but let's do it. Let's do this. Pry out stone. Okay. Speed. War blessing. Now hurry up and get here before my fun wears off again. Looks like War Blasting is quite helpful, maybe. I'm just here to renew it if I need to. Oi! Oh no! Not enough action points to heal my buds. God! Everything's wrong. Why can't something just go right for once? Oh yeah, we've got this on lockdown or whatever the fluff people say. I wish they could get here a bit faster though. Let me bloody drop these for now. Then maybe I can have enough. Yeah, I've got strength now. Just remember to pick them up afterwards. I'm selling all my steel javelins because I'm never going to use them, especially with the damage they do. I think it's like 7 to 36 or something. Which is just bugger all, basically. Yeah, boy! We've got this. Piss easy. Finally, something to take off the list. One step closer to dealing with those bloody augmented twats as well. I guess. Whoa! Whoa! various other sounds. There are a lot of them around here. It's probably going to take a sec. Or two. Oh! Guess I better just remember to look out for the speed wearing off in case I need to renew it. Which I probably shouldn't need to. We've probably dealt with enough now that it's not going to be a big deal. last a decent time. Speed. It can make or break any adventure. And it makes it by breaking it, because this is broken. Oh, 
Gosh, man. How did anyone ever struggle? Any more? Oh, looks like we're done. We may indeed be done. Okay, then. Let's go around and get the rest of our gems. Is there even anything special? Oh. Oh, what? Gemstone and emerald. I guess they're probably more valuable. Yeah, because I need money right now. Money is what I'm lacking. No, it's places to sell things that I'm lacking. Oh, I did forget to pick up the silly javelins. It's alright, I'll get them on the way back. Don't you worry. Oh, look, the pylons are marked on the map as well by a little grey wood, which I can barely see because colour blind. Are there any dead bodies around here? From, like, the people who stole that gem? Because that one wasn't there. Maybe somewhere. Because these games are good at attention to detail like that. I mean, there's plenty of bones everywhere, but these don't look human. Like they got, like, animal skull, maybe. I don't know. Oh, no. I wonder if this guy has anything to say about poor Rackus. I'm sorry. I didn't... I didn't want to... Perhaps these gloves even weren't you weren't you it. What weren't worth it? But but yeah. Um. No, he's not bothered. Do you know Rackus? No. That's fine then. Nice spoon, dude. I mean, it's not fine because I'd rather not have killed him. But I mean, put him to sleep. He's just napping now. He's in Sovngarde eating some twats. As in Nords. Good. Kill all of the Nords so that Skyrim can belong to the Argonians instead. Right then. We're off out of here. And we're done with this part as well. Rackus is there, and his ghost's done. Isn't it nice to get something done? It is. I don't know about the staffs. What did the bone and ivory staffs even do? Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm going to go off in search of a merchant. Oh, there was one in Tribal Woods, wasn't there? Yeah, I'll do that. And I'll see you next time, in which we'll probably head to Spirit City, as I planned to originally. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Crack open a cold one for poor Rackus. Oh! Holy shit, those emeralds! Uh, no, the Tribal Woods merchant was broke, so I'm just back here in the Yonk Yard. And what did I find? Something I didn't explore. Nothing here, though. Oh, so I equipped the leaded shield that I nicked from Rackus. 50% mind resistance, same armor as I had before. And I was already, like, full-on stun resistance. Now I've got 100 mind resistance. Yum, yum, yum.